Hi and welcome on board to OWASP Bricks Training. Today, we will see how to break content page 3. This page is accepting inputs through post parameter. I'm opening up Hackbar and loading the URL and post data to manipulate them. I just put a single quote in the URL and it shows an error message. Let's confirm the vulnerability by injecting an end statement. The injection is successful since it accepts user submitted SQL queries. It proves the page is vulnerable to SQL injection attack. Let's find out the number of columns by order by statement. The trick here is to craft the inputs in such a way that it will show up error message for invalid column number. Let's keep increasing the number till we see an error message on the screen. We have got an error message on number 9, so the number of valid columns are 8. Let's make an appropriate union select statement. Numbers of vulnerable columns are being displayed on the screen. Let's find out user, database and version details first. Let's try to find out the table name on Bricks database. Now that we have database and table name, let's find out column names. Let's fetch out name and password details of all the users. Voila, we made it.